Good evening, good people. Tony Rogers here on this Friday, the 8th of November, um, 2023. And we're taking a good look at the Football Manager 2024. Now, I've now got three saves going. I've got Alton Town, which is my hometown where I used to live. I've got Everton Legends, where I'm putting all the legends that used to play for Everton into the team. And I've got Surviving the Premiership. And today we're going to be concentrating on Surviving the Premiership. Because I found that with me Alton Town save, they weren't doing very well. I mean, they drew one game, they lost one game and drew one. So I thought I'd try another formation. I, I tried 4-3-3. And I'll tell you what. They, well, we're going to try on this one now. Tika Toka, and we'll go for 4-3-3. That's what we want. Yeah, so we're going to go 4-3-3. Well, that's meant to be 4-3-3, but it's not, is it? So, what I did was, right, I put Sharp over here. As advance forward attack, we'll put Gray up here as a target forward attack, and we'll have another one. Uh, have we got another striker, Dixie Dean? And come in for, and he can go up there. Advance forward attack, and then we'll bring Sheedy down here. Come on, Sheedy, you know you want to. Or oh, you want to go over there, do you? Right, so. So, I know we ain't got any on the left there. But what I might do is put Will over there, Harvey there. And I'm, I'll be honest, they really did start playing. Uh, uh, in the, the Alton Town save, they really started whacking in the goals and all that. So, let's have a quick butchers. So hopefully, if this uh, works, we should get the same result here. Right, I'm not going to bother with them. Right, let's see what happens anyway. The thing is, it's alright doing it with friendlies. You really want it. Mink Lions, chat, Captain, okay. I'll sod it. Right. Oh. 
はいはい So what I'm basically doing is, well, oh, we're in that. Roger Kenyon injured. This is the only thing. We're getting a lot of injuries. So, we got Leck away. See, this is bloody, this is what I hate as well, because if you ask them to make a quick decision on the, uh, the contract, They turn round and say, no, I'll, I'll make the decision when I'm ready. Well, I suppose that's, that's just a bit unreal. I, I, I'll be honest, I do like this. And uh, I'm hoping I'm hoping we can get Was it not? This is what annoys me. Even this bloody shit comes up. All this... I, I, I must find a way of turning this off. Gary Stevens injured. So, let's have a look. Anyone injured? Uh, if you click on that, it tells you that, like, obviously, there's no, yeah. You need that to be green, really. We want no nonsense defenders. Right. Let's see then if this affects this team as well. Alan Whittle doesn't want to be uh, playing it. I'm about to bring it back at the... Um Match review.
Right, Everton Legends underway then. See what happens. The few names still need changing. Labone to Whittle. Carvey, Gray. Back to Labone. Whittle, Harvey, Graham Sharp, Alan Whittle, 1-0, Alan Whittle, as Vintage Everton, Let's see if we can get uh, Got a name for him yet? Alone. Dixie Dean! Dixie Dean! And there's Everton two. What a racking. Brian Lebone crosses it in. There's Dixie Dean. So I can say it's okay doing all these friendlies. Andy Gray and Dixie Dean makes it 3 0. Looks like the 4 3 3 is the way to go. Run sharp for the free kick. Sharp pull. And straight over the bar. Leak nil, Everton three. Now. Nice tackle there, Harvey to Sharp. Comes Eastbrook. Oh, over the bar. So Davis had it covered. Oh, good goal. Shay Coleman. Kenyon, Andy Gray, and a whistle, Graham Sharp, penalties given. Oh, was it a penalty? Well. Dixie Dean, Graham Sharp. Sharp, a nice bit of dribbling from Sharp. with the yellow card. 
Harvey. Sheedy. Harvey. Kendall could be coming on in a minute. The gold. One of the art. The Holy Trinity, I think they were called. Oh, it's got to be. It's Alan Whittle. Oh, has it been disallowed? Disallowed. Offside. Would you... Half-time breakdown. Now... So it's starting the second half. White Lions. Oh, oh! Oh, that would have been a fine goal there. Headed towards the post. And also what you've got is you've got stuff like I can have a look at here. And you've got the stuff you can have a look at the other team as well. But with this in the way I can't show you. Oh he throws! Like this, so I can see what they're doing, I, but I can't access it at the moment. There's definitely a sound bug in here with the sound keeps going. Andy Gray. Alan Whittle. Oh, what a goal from Whittle. Lovely goal from Whittle. Alan Ball, no Joe, Joe Royal's coming on, oh Kevin Sheedy, Alan Ball for Colin Harvey, Kendall for Alan Whittle. Let's see how that does. Defence midfield there. We'll bring on Derek Bird for a little uh, ball. Andy Gray shouldn't be there. Alan Ball gets he did, he gets the rebound. Oh yes, Andy Gray. Andy Gray scores number five. It's hard luck the defender come off the defender and went to Dixie Dean. And he crosses it to Andy Gray. Alan Ball with the free kick. Joe Royal. Mandy Gray. Oh, what a goal from Mandy Gray. 
just hope they can do this in a league match. Yeah, I think they've done a really good job. It was an own goal, to be honest. But look at that, it was an own goal. Right, some players need to come off who are knackered. Uh, Mike Lyons. Uh, Sandy Boone, which we haven't got. Definitely need another. Uh, we could put Trevor Stephen there, sod it. Roger Kenyon, which really haven't got another. We could put Manfield there. Brian LeBone, we need another left midfield as well. Uh, Mark Thompson can go up instead of Sharp. I'll tell you what, we'll bring Nick Howell on and bring him down. Have I got anybody else? I will put Jimmy Husband up there instead of Dixie Dean. That means we should have. I think also what I'll do is if so like if someone comes in and wants to uh, buy Howard Kendall I'll uh, put their name back to what it was and if he goes then I'll put their name back to uh what it originally was. So, I need... We've not even started the season yet. But if you look at the old fixtures... Oh, it's not too bad. We've got Swindon, who are... Skybet League 2. So, if we can get a good result against Swindon, then... I'm just wondering. Uh, we search. Go for the under 18s. Yeah. Let's see what comes up. Everton Legends versus Everton under 18s. Oh, they've accepted it.
Yeah. Oh, that. Fall back, is he on? Oh, left, yeah, we could do with him, actually. And what I've also found is that, say like you've got some of these readied out because you can't afford it. You go to adjust budget, and adjust your budget, then it grays out. You can do it. 119 million I've got uh, to play with. Uh, no, don't want that. 19 ohm. Um, No, nah, don't want him. Goalkeeper. See, a goalkeeper, we may be... I'm going to sign him. Bloody hell. Oh, a hundred pounds per week. I thought it was a hundred thousand. Oh, yeah, you were. One thousand four hundred per week. I'm right. Like I said, it's it's a a lot to do in this. It's a long game, but like I said, I, I really do like this. Actually, I honestly do like this. But like I said, it takes ages to get a game done. The only annoying thing about this is that. When you um, you have that uh, tutorial thing come up, and it gets annoying. And I want to see what they do against Swindon. Right, I'll tell you what I'll do is I'll bring him in there because he was upset last time, wasn't he?
Alex Young. Yes, basically what I'm trying to do is get it. Everton players who have played for Everton in the past. Tommy Lawson. Was it Martin Dobson? We mustn't forget him either. We got Martin Dobson. We could put Martin Dobson on. He can come through the ranks. <laughs> Oh, we got the uh, you. You got the great. Um, what's it? Um, Helton. Well, he's got quite a few. There's only one name in there for him. Bob the Latchford. Um, anyway, let's see how they do against Swindon. Now, Swindon are a league. A league above this team. So, if we can get at least a draw... That would be interesting. But I've always found... Um, let's see what we do against league, a league a team called Swindon. Everton Legends. Le Bone, a horrible day here in Merseyside. Harvey, Le Bone, all the way back to Doy Davis. Oh, what's he done? Has he let him in? Oh, that should have been. That should have been one nil. That should have been one nil to uh, Swindon. Davis got a hand to it. Probably a good thing then it would be a VAR because they might have actually given a penalty for that. I think he was outside the box, so would have been a free kick and possibly a sending off. Ball comes in. Oh! I'm not doing too bad against Swindon. Oh, it was, it was Tommy Lawton, wasn't it? Whistle! Tommy Lawton. Was it David Lawson as well? 
I think there was, I'll have to look at that now. Is it at half time? Was there an Everton player called David Lawson? Yeah, David went to Everton. He was uh, come from Huddersfield. He was a goalkeeper called David Lawson. Thought that happened. David Lawson. <laughs> I'll do go on Google there checking that out. Little Harvey. Oh Graham Sharp and Andy Gray. This is it. Andy Gray, what were you doing? comes Kemp, Kemp, oh Levon, Harvey, oh Harvey what are you doing, oh, I'll tell you what, Swindon, should be winning this, think we should be 2-0 up, we could easily be 1-0 up in a minute, Oh, good save from Joe Davis. Right, let's see what we can do. Because we're not doing too well. Blind the bone up there. Alex Young up there, we'll have Joe Royal coming on, Alan Ball coming on, uh, three, apparently 352 is quite a... Um, Uh, quite a good, uh, what's it called, uh, formation to have as well. Right. All change at Goodison Park. Tony Rogers is gone for a... Just done that. Oh, nil nil. Well, you got to remember that they were a league above us. Um, so. Oh, we'll see you want.
Right, so he wants a new contract, as he kind of, yeah. Right, okay. Where is he? There you go. It's got a contract. Yeah, so that's basically Football Manager 2024. I'm really pleased with that. I'm really happy with that. There's a few players that are still a bit unhappy at the moment, and I don't know why. Um, but don't worry about that. We'll sort them out. Um, actually, it's not. It's not. They're okay. It's lacking sharpness. Yeah. They need more training. Neville Southall. Right then, so I'll call that it for now then. But like I said, that's my review of uh, Football Manager 2024. I love it. I really do. I think it's a big improvement. And uh, I think we're going to do okay with it. So uh, I should really give the uh, surviving the old um, premiership a go, shouldn't I? Oh, well, tatty bye for now.